Hello everyone. We're playing Orbit Industries once again. Thanks again for Kablater for providing us with the key. I, I kind of messed it up uh, earlier because uh, I forgot who gave me the key. But uh, I'll try to be a bit better with that in these things. Um, anyway, today we are going to work on this circuit board. I want to make it a little bit more efficient. So we're going to pause it a little bit. It's paused. Okay. And can destroy these wires here. So I saw, oh shoot. Uh, I saw a bit of the trailer and it gave me an idea of what to do. So I'm going to try to replicate that thing. Um, so I'm trying to figure it out. So this so the thing is, this is a circuit board, right? We want to treat it as a circuit board, which means the connections have to correspond to a thing, each one of them. So we're going to do that. We're going to organize it a little bit. Make sure things are nice and tidy. Oh. So you can, you can draw these traces and make sure that they correspond to something. I, I want it neat and organized. So the best way to do it, so we need more environmental control, I think. These modules were failing because we didn't have enough of a certain thing. So we'll, we'll try to correct that. Second here. Um, so let's make sure you get the right stuff here. So we can build. Um, here's our lab. Our administration thing. And the circuit board can be 3D. Wait. That's if we want to make more than one lab. I'm going to space it out a little bit. So that these are airlocks here. So the essential components we'll put here. Anything that needs to be connected to something has to face up, right? At least this is how I'm going to organize it. Okay. So we're going to space these out. I think though this should be okay like that. Well, what happens if we need more than one? That's the thing I have to think about. Think about that.
So I'm going to make sure the traces go like that. There's a habitat. Habitat could be here. Okay. An orange could be like that. And do orange like this. Right. I'll make it all neat. And pull it all, all in the same line. Okay. All right. I'm getting somewhere. So the first line should be yellow. So you run into a problem though, where they might overlap. I want to try to avoid that. Okay, so this one. This is one of these things. I'm gonna make sure the traces are neat. And it goes like that. I can have these like that. Actually, I want to make sure it doesn't overload. So those intersect like that. Blue. I'm gonna decide on blue here. So this might need to move. So I need to move to. Okay, blue. It's like that. Okay. Should be enough space now. Usually that means this line might be easier to have this like this. Okay, like that. Mm -hmm. Looks cleaner like this, but I can see it getting a uh, little bit too uh, too much. So we could put over here like this and uh, make it like that. Same thing with this. I don't know. Wonder if we can make it. What is this circuit energy? What is this? Okay. Got that. Need the orange here. Okay. Let's see if this works. 33%. Oh, we need this connected. We need the blue. Twenty-five percent. Why is that? We don't have enough environmental, I think. So, let's see, what is this? Should be environmental. Where do we have another environmental at? I think it's these. Yep. These are airlocks. It's a trillion battery. We can put the environmental here. But I want this symmetrical wish. Sorry if you're dizzy. I get dizzy too. 
with these kind of games, but I'm starting to get better at them. I get there are moments I become desensitized to a bunch of things. So let's see. Well. Let's make this into a... Uh, let's do... That one. Let's do that, do that. Spell that. Let's do another one. And then we could... Do this, do that. We could do this. Let's do something like this. We can do this. All right. I have to keep in mind what, how much I'm spending. Because I could run out easily. And I could do this thing here. Or I can do that. Or Do this. This might be better. Okay, this one will be environmental. Alright. Let's deploy environmental. Okay. Oh. It didn't have any power. Now it has power. Okay. We're at 89%. 90% efficiency. Looks like it's all connected. 92%. What else are we missing here? Airlock's working. Looks like the administration's only got 90% of stuff. Why is that? Oh, transfer power comes from the airlock. So we need more of the airlock. We need an airlock, so let's see. We can we put an airlock? Let's extend this here. Let's put this longer. Okay, we got a bridge. Put an airlock here. It's a battery. Oh, cancel. Uh, dismantle that. So, let's see. Put an airlock here. A, a lock. There you go. Alright. Let's build that airlock. And now I'm supposed to pause. But, uh... I don't know. 
just like the other games that I play. I'm gonna play it like that. Where I'm playing on the go, right? Alright, okay, let's see how this goes. Okay. Do that. And eight percent and transfer power should be good. Right. Ninety-nine percent. What else do we not have enough of? A ninety-nine percent efficiency here we got transfer stuff. Input max. 100%. Wherever it's beeping, I think, will show what's missing. Our workforce is not enough. So that's provided by the Habitat capsule, is it? Supply 167. Okay. Oh, whoops. Alright. So let's make a habitat capsule. It's not one of those. Okay. Let's see a system. Alright. We have another HCA system. System. And let's deploy that. This one here, actually. And yeah, let's do that. And then. Okay. So we're supplying 170. Demand is 172. Now we have enough. Okay, we're at 100% efficiency. We sold it. All right, let's go to the SMI. Station management interface, and so we can take on our active mission is complete. Virtually fireproof, airtight, securely sealed bulkhead. Separates two modules. All right. Let's do our research here. Modern design meeting room with technical equipment. Try this. So what else? What's ready? We can do assessment of troops, the quadrant. We could put another lab. It'll uh, free up another thing. Uh, so where, where can we put the lab here? Fair enough. I'm trying to make this look symmetrical, but it's looks different. So right here we can extend. Uh, yep. Right. Extend here. Okay, now we're here, we could make a, what should we make? A lab, where the other labs faced? This is okay like this, right? Okay, we built a lab. 
I gotta deploy it. Oh, could I have it like right here? And these connections will be interesting. All right. First connection is here. So second would be this. Okay. Third one would be here. Do we have enough power and everything? 98%. Needs more power. Don't have power. Alright. Let's put more power. So, power is right there. Alright, let's connect that. A trillion battery. Trivium battery. Okay, connect it like that. Okay, let's see how that is. Okay, we should be at a hundred percent. Lab's good. We don't have enough people again. Well, we should have enough people. I don't understand. Oh, we need what. What is this? More environmental? Alright, we need environmental systems. Yeah, this thing's getting different, All right? Let's put environmental on there. We might need to reorganize stuff, but. Three right there. Luckily, it's not crossing the lines. Right, we're at a hundred percent. There we go. Let's go check out the SMI. And we got two complete stuff here. Status complete. Recording analysis of distribution of troops in the squadron. Okay. Station overview. Mission details. Resource details. Module error history. Thermal incident. We can change. Oh, we can change the name. Alright. We can do more research, I think. Nightway Low Energy Computing Data Unit used for controlling programmable analytical tasks requested by all other supported module. Do that. EM radio telescope with frequency range between 140 megahertz. So this unlocks parts, right? Okay. Open positions. It's invalid. All right. Mission invalid. It needs that. Which one is that? Oh, this is our BCE, isn't it? What is this? Core. I don't have any core. And a lab. Okay. Hmm. 
Okay, not too bad. Well, we'll call this uh, a good stopping point. We uh, we finally fixed up our circuit board, so it's all color coded, and actually can do a bit better here. That is. Let's do it like this. Is it doing it like that? Okay. Do it like that. We have this here. Little... Hmm. First one should be this thing here. Hmm. It's like a, uh, a tank on top. Alright. Do it like that. It has to be like that. Mm. Well, well, uh... Is this the first? This one the second. Mm -hmm. It's a good thing I looked at the, uh, the trailer and gave me a hint. And how to do this. I don't know if I like the design room. Takes up a lot of space. But anyway, we'll we'll call this a good stopping point. I uh do an exam in the morning, so I'm gonna use the time to finish up study. Uh, I want to thank you all for watching. You've been watching Morbid Industries. I only remember the name. It's a pretty nice game. Thanks again for Kablader for giving us the key. Providing us with early access. Once again, this game is coming out. It's on open beta. It's available on GOG and Steam. And it will be completed or released for public view on April 21st, 2022. So I guess they're wanting people to get feedback on this. I like it so far. I don't want to reserve judgment for until I complete at least one mission. As you can see, I definitely like this kind of game it's it's very makes me want to think right as a engineer as somebody who likes uh putting things together i have an ocd of certain things and this definitely helps with my uh you know how I think of things, so, yeah, fulfills that part of my brain that likes these kind of things. Anyway, thank you all for the likes in the past couple of weeks. Uh, you're letting me know what kind of content you want. And I, I've, I've said it before. I'll say it again, if, if you do like the content, hit the like button. And if you don't want to miss future videos, hit the subscribe button. Ding that bell and I'll see you in three days. This is John Nezidan signing out. Take care, stay safe, and remember, you're essential. The next couple of things we're going to do is continue with the missions. And yeah. I'll see you guys later. Take care.